Hello folks, so I wanted to make a follow-up video to the previous video where you saw me fixing my CGX mount and I, I did have to go back and make an adjustment. When I showed you how I, um, I mentioned how I screwed that distance adjustment screw in tight on the deck gears that did come back to haunt me. Even though I got away with that way back on the RA gears, it, it didn't really work out for me on the deck gears and this is what happened. You can look at my my I assume this is just a ton of backlash going on. You can see here um, it's just taken forever for my mount to respond to these fixes, these corrections that PHD2 is trying to send to it and finally the, the deck came back down but then over here it started up again and it would not correct even though I'm sending all these corrections to it. And it was even worse on dithering. There was no way it was going to recover from that. And my um, uh, C SG Pro was not going to start the next image because it couldn't settle after the dither. So I did have to loosen up that screw a little bit and give a little recoil to those gears. And I'm hoping that fixed it. I haven't seen that backlash since I fixed it. And the weird thing is, is I was pointing to a certain part of the sky on that first night out, which was fine, but on the second night out, the same part of the sky, I started seeing all that backlash. So, I, like I mentioned before, I, I'm, I'm just going to keep an eye on the guiding and, uh, and just uh, adjust that screw as needed until I find the sweet spot. Right now, my guiding is looking very good, but I'm pointing north, of course, so it's always good in the north, so... Anyway, I just wanted to make sure you knew that uh, that fix I had in the video wasn't final. I did have to come back and make an adjustment. Hey, before I let you go, I, I wanted to show you one more picture here. I finally finished off the Helix in the Hubble palette. I had already made a video on this in HOO, but I'm not going to make another video. But since I, I didn't upload this video yet, I had time to finish this Helix, and I'll just stick it on the end of this CGX video. But that's, that's how my Hubble version looked, and boy, th this was tough because I was only able to grab barely over an hour and a half of sulfur. That, I mean, that's it for me. The helix is out of view now, so I did what I could on it. I'll probably stick this in Astro Bin, but it was rough. <laughs> in, in, you can see what I went through with all these crazy versions, and that's not even all of them. I spent a few hours trying to get something I liked, and... Uh, here, let me, let me show you some of this other stuff. Here's another folder with the... That one's not too bad, but I kind of like that one better. But And it gets even worse here. Let's see, though. Where was I going with this one? How's that one compared to this one? Eh, I don't know. The background is pretty terrible there. It, it's kind of funny when I do go back, though, and... Well, that's dreadful. Uh, well, very best. I call that one very best, but that's very noisy, too. <laughs> I'm going with this one. I don't care. So, anyway, okay, I won't keep you guys any longer. That's what I got. I don't think it's glossy print worthy, but uh, I'll just keep it in my collection and it, probably see it again in my 2019 wrap-up video. All right, see you guys later.